A New York Times Siena College poll shows former President Trump leads current President Joe Biden in five of the six battleground states. But UVA Center for Politics says it's a little early to jump to election conclusions. NBC 29's Destiny Harris joins us to highlight these early numbers. Hi, Destiny. Steve, President Biden is behind in Nevada, Georgia, Arizona, Michigan, and Pennsylvania. Wisconsin is the only state where he's ahead. Now the question is, how much can we rely on poll predictions? I would take polls, you know, that were taken a year ahead of the election time with a bit of a grain of salt just because a lot of things can change. According to the New York Times and Tiana College poll, President Biden is trailing former President Trump in five of the six battleground states that helped him win in 2020. So I think, you know, by this time next year, I think people will see the election as more of a choice between Trump and Biden as opposed to just a referendum on Biden. Right now, the poll shows Biden is losing support with black and Hispanic voters. Coleman says that does not mean people should count him out. You know, perfect example, after the 2010 midterms, o Obama was looking like he was in a very tough position, uh, but he comes back and he's reelected. Um, so I think, you know, it definitely is not a result that the Democrats want to see, uh, but the good news for them is that there's time. The poll found roughly 6% of voters across Arizona, Georgia, Nevada, Pennsylvania, and Wisconsin would switch from Trump to Biden if Trump is convicted. That's a big enough swing to ensure Biden's, Biden's re-election. In the studio, Destiny Harris, NBC 29 News at 5.